What's up, OCC gang? I'm at Michael's for the lowest prices of the season, but that's not exactly why I'm here. I don't want to deceive you guys. I'm also here because today is one of my favorite days. You guys know I do this all the time. So for those of you who know what I'm talking about, why are you still sitting there? Get your shoes on. You know exactly what's about to happen. Okay, so I'm just coming into Michael's now. I'm gonna get a cart, just in case I see anything awesome that I wanna get, but I already know what I'm here for. Okay, so I have one of the grab boxes in my cart, but since we're here, I'm figuring I might at least go around and look at other things to see what's actually on sale in the store. So if you're looking for Easter stuff, Easter decor is 50% off, and then they have like Easter baskets and things like that for a dollar. Let's see what else there is. Okay, yeah, Easter stuff is like 50% off. There's some pretty good things if you were looking. I really think these carrot, <laughs> this is really cute. They have lots of nice little Easter garland. I guess you can call it Easter garland. This is really cute. Okay, oh my goodness, these pillows are amazing. Like I wouldn't usually splurge on something like this, but with 50% off, if you have like a garden area or if your house has this thing, that would be really adorable or for your little one especially if it's their first easter this is really cute oh my gosh they have little lambs and all this stuff this stuff is really cute so if you were kind of wondering where to go for your easter stuff i think michael's has a pretty decent selection and the prices aren't bad and with that 50 percent off it should make it pretty okay What's up, OCC gang? I just ran into Rhonda at Michael's and she already knew what I was here for. I'm here for a $4 grab box. Did you get it? I did not. She I did, did not. <laughs> I looked in there, it has a lot of uh, ribbon. So okay. I was like, well, oh, you know, ribbon. It's not everything that you need, but you know, I'm thinking about it. I might. She was thinking about it, but she didn't get any, so I'm gonna look and see if there's anything in there that I want and I'll show you guys what's inside. I knew Erica was coming, so I left it for her. Thank you. <laughs> I think I've just found what I need to make my life a lot simpler. Look at this, a 10 drawer rolling cart. Only $30, it has 10 drawers. You guys, I could probably store my inserts in here and arrange them by the week. This would make my life so much easier. Oh my gosh, look at this. And you know what, the clear one might be even better because I could see like what inserts are inside. I think I need something like this. Like what do you guys put your inserts in if you have like a ton of inserts, not just like a few. But like if you have a ton of inserts, what's one way that you organize yours? I could totally see myself getting one of these though. This is pretty cool. Let's get a side view. Yeah, I feel like this would make my life so much easier. It comes in this box. So here's the specs. There's the size if anybody was curious. Totally want one of these. I should have put this on my birthday list. Okay, so I think this is the best thing I've seen today. You usually only see these prices around Christmas time, but Michael's candles, five for 10, and these are the full-size jar candles. Oh my gosh, five for 10 for the big ones. They're regularly $6 each, and that's even a pretty good price because these smell just as good as Yankee Candle. I'm telling you the truth. Like, I've gotten these before. You guys know I talk about these a lot. They're only $2 each. That's a great price. Okay guys, so now I'm going to look at the boxes. I think this is really all that's left. Wow, okay, so if you're new and you haven't done this before, Michaels does $4 grab boxes. It depends on what store you're at. Some have boxes, some have bags. My store usually has boxes and that makes me one of the lucky ones. They don't like you to really open them. You kind of have to buy them to see what's inside. It's supposed to be like a mystery box or a surprise box, but like Rhonda said, she kind of peeked inside and there was only ribbon so i don't know if it's really going to be worth getting but for occ gang you know i'm going to get at least one usually they have them here and there's like a ton of them but unfortunately i got here pretty late and there's only two left so i'm going to get at least one and leave the last one for somebody else and we'll go see what's inside okay so it's my turn and i'm taking my box to the register i had to give up my cart but Here's my $4 box, it's getting scanned, and guys, it really does only come out to $4 plus tax. So I'm getting this box, and we'll pop it open and see what's inside, and I'm guilty. I also ended up getting one of these cart things that we saw, because I really wanted it, so I'm getting that too. How are you? Good, thank you. <laughs> okay, so I'm leaving now. I have my $4 box, and I also ended up getting this cart thing. But I need it, I needed to put my inserts up. I wanna be a better person. 
I got my $4 box. I got the cart that I really wanted. I needed this cart to put my inserts in so I don't feel bad about that. But they also gave me a coupon for $5 off for my next visit, which I wasn't expecting, but you know I was excited about. I hope Rhonda got one, but I got this coupon for $5 off on my next visit, so I'm definitely gonna use that, and I think this was like the bomb trip. So let's open the $4 box and see what's inside. Okay, so I'm just gonna open the box. Please excuse the cheese balls. I'm gonna donate them later. So, yeah, these were the cheese balls from Dollar General that we got for 50 cents. I didn't eat them, so I'm thinking I need to donate them before they expire. So I put them back in the car, but. Okay, so it's all St. Patrick's Day stuff. That's pretty cool. This was regularly $14, so to get it in this box, I only paid $4 for the whole box. So, I mean, it's really a win-win. This was $5. I'm sure I could find a use for some of it. I don't know. I really don't see a use for it just yet. Okay, so yeah. <laughs> so guys, really, it's all St. Patrick's Day stuff. But if you have like, I don't know, someone's birthday and they're into Irish things or you're doing like, I don't want to say like a pub themed day or but these coins could be used for something i don't know or you could just hold it till st patrick's day which seems like the most logical thing okay oh look happy st patrick's day cupcake holders baking cups they were two dollars and oh socks now i'm wearing these i don't care i'm wearing the socks i'll wear them today it doesn't matter when it is they were regularly five dollars so that's a good deal there's oh wow okay so this wreath wow fifty dollars was the original price and it was in my four dollar box along with everything else so it says welcome great perfect that was perfect this could be repurposed i don't know maybe you could take like the giant shamrock out of the back i'm i'm reaching never mind <laughs> and last but not least ta -da! A black shamrock which could definitely be repurposed this could totally be a butterfly right right I don't think I'm reaching this could totally be a butterfly and like take that off tie some ribbon around it or something I don't know I'm not crafty I'm just messing like messing around trying to think of some ideas I'm not a crafty person at all but I only paid four dollars for everything in this box they do it every season so after Christmas wait about a couple weeks and then you can get a Christmas box after like the fall season same thing after Thanksgiving after the 4th of July and after Easter they're gonna do it again so just kind of be ready but let's go ahead and go to Family Dollar and do some digital deals what's up OCC gang we are now at Family Dollar let's go inside and get these deals we don't need to waste any time I'm just gonna go ahead and grab a cart and get right to it I'm gonna get the black cart they have the red ones I'm gonna go ahead and choose this black cart and get in the store so the first item that I'm going to get is going to be the Game Fabric Softener. It's on sale this week for $3.45 and we have a $1 off smart coupon which will make it only $2.45. So I'm going to go ahead and grab one of these and add it to my cart. And just for those of you who are newbies, the scent doesn't matter. The size does matter on these though. And the sizes will be specified on the coupons. But I'm going to go ahead and get original scent and go ahead and just add that to my cart. The next item that I'm going to get is going to be the Bounce. I'm going to get the 100 105 count it's priced at 395 which is a great deal because the regular price was five dollars so 395 is a great deal already but we have a two dollar off smart coupon which brings us all the way down to 195 so 195 is a price I would definitely pay so now I have my bounce and I'm gonna add that to my cart so right now this is what my cart is looking like I have my gain softener and I have my bounce that's all I have so far let's keep going let's add a few more items the next item I'm going to add is going to be the Ajax. The regular price on this one is $2 and I'm looking at the 28 ounce. That's the ounce that you want to get. That's the ounce that the coupon is for. $2. And it's on sale this week for $1.88. And we have a $1 off smart coupon which makes it only $0.88. Cents. Yes, I'm going to get it. That is a great deal so I'm definitely getting this. I'm going to start to put my items down here so that we can see them better. Okay, because the cart is going to start filling up and I want to have enough room. So if you're doing this with me, these are the three items that you should have so far. And you should have your three 
smart coupons clipped on your family dollar app so now i'm gonna go ahead and keep adding items i think we're doing pretty good we're going pretty fast not wasting any time no need to do unnecessary talking or walking around let's get right into the next item the next item we're going to get is going to be Tide Detergent. My store isn't marked, but it's on sale this week for $4.95. And you can see that in your Family Dollar ad, which is why I always encourage you to look at the ad on your app or at least pick up the ad when you walk into the store because sometimes stores get busy and they don't always have time to hang those sales tags. But the Tide is on sale this week for $4.95 and we have a $2 off smart coupon. Okay, so $4.95, $2 off smart coupon makes it only $2.95, which is a great price for Tide. So I'm definitely gonna go ahead and pick up one of these and add it to my cart. So this is what it's looking like so far. I have all four of these items. Let's keep going. Right now I'm trying to decide if I wanna add more household items like detergent and things like that or if I want to switch it over to some health and beauty let's see I think I'm gonna look at a few more household cleaning items next thing I'm gonna get is gonna be the all detergent it's on sale this week for 345 and that's if I can actually find one my store doesn't seem to have any left so I'm gonna have to look around I know they were stocking yesterday so I'll look around but you guys know that if I can't find any we always have room for a substitution so if I don't find any there we might need to substitute for the snuggle so that's what we'll look for now and if you don't want to substitute for the snuggle we can always do tight pods so since my store doesn't have any of the all left that I want I'm gonna go ahead and substitute for the snuggle they're both on sale for 345 and we have a $1 off smart coupon so that's gonna make this 245 and remember we have options so if you can't find the all go ahead and go with the snuggle both of them are great deals and I use both of them snuggle smells really good anyway you guys know I'm always talking about this little cuddly bear so I'm not mad about doing the snuggle so if you have one or the other to make the choice go ahead and make a choice and add it to your cart so my cart is starting to look pretty full and I'm happy with everything that I've gotten so far but here's a visual for you if you're doing this along with me go ahead and start writing this down I think it really really builds your coupon character when you start writing down and taking notes and typing things up for yourself sometimes you might want to screenshot things or um, I don't know just create a mental visual of the things that you want to get on your shopping trip it's not always beneficial to print someone else's breakdown it's not always beneficial to go off of someone else's breakdown not even mine because what will happen is one day you'll find yourself without a video or without a printable breakdown or without someone's Instagram post and then what will you do how will you support yourself as a couponer that's never good so always make sure that you know what you're getting and that it makes absolute sense to you first before it makes sense to just that YouTuber or that Instagrammer or that vlogger, blogger, whatever. You need to know first that this breakdown will make sense for your life and for you. So write things down, type things up, pull out your calculator on your phone or go old school and get a calculator. But whatever you do, make sure you know how to coupon first by yourself before you become dependent on someone else. Okay, our breakdowns are really just kind of to show you and help you and give you kind of like a guideline but by no means rely on them completely rely on yourself because at the end of the day that's what you have you have your own smarts to help you save money the next item we're gonna get is gonna be the suave two-in-one the suave professionals in the silver bottle is usually the cheapest that they have I mean it's the most affordable one that they sell and it's always included and I really like that this one is still suave professionals it's a two-in-one and it's priced at only 215 we're going to get two of those so get two of these suave two-in-ones priced at 215 each and we have a three dollar off two digital so you'll be getting two for 430 and then the coupon will take off three dollars that's a really great deal okay so this cart is really filling up guys I think we've made some pretty awesome choices in what we're getting here today next and last but not least I have one more health and beauty item that we're gonna get then we'll go ahead and get out of here now our last item is going to be the ponds they're priced at two dollars each and I'm gonna go ahead and get two of them they're priced at two dollars each that's four dollars when you get two and we have a two dollar off smart coupon when you buy two so you would be buying two that equals four dollars the coupon would take off two dollars leaving you to only pay two dollars for two I think that's a great deal now you do have other options to what you can get there are several 
sales that are available. This is all that I'm getting though. But if you want it to mix and match your deal, this Colgate is a great deal. They're $3 each and we have a digital coupon for $4 off when you buy two. So you would be buying two for $6 using your $4 off digital and paying only $2 for two. That's one of the deals that you might want to explore. I'm not going to be doing that one, but I think it's a really, really nice deal. Also, the Tide Pods are $4.95 and you have a $2 off digital that'll make your Tide Pods only $2.95. Let me tell you guys about another deal that I really thought was a great deal too that a lot of people are probably not going to do. And it's unfortunate because people really chase deals that have a lot of the things that I'm getting but people very rarely do food deals. And I'm really open to doing food deals. And I wanted to do a food deal today but I know you guys are more interested in getting a low total sometimes than you are in food. But let me know in the comments if you're more interested in food and we'll do food now. There is a smart coupon on the Family Dollar app for $2 off when you spend $10 on Eats food products. Check it out. A lot of the Eats products are only $1. And when you combine this with the 5 off 25, you can really save. And I think that's a pretty good deal. They have sugar-free items and regular sugar cookies, classics like iced oatmeal. And it's $2 off when you spend 10. I mean, if you need it snacks anyway, it just kind of makes sense to get them here and use that digital. Don't always end up getting stuff that you already have stocked up if you need food. What if your kid needs like classroom snacks? And I know some people are always like, oh, that's junk food. That's junk food. Well, they also have healthy things like nuts and all kinds of peanuts and almonds, all this kind of stuff. There's always going to be people who call this kind of stuff trash. Well, everyone cannot afford to shop at Whole Foods and Fresh Market every day. Some people rely on deals like this to get wholesome food or food that at least comes close to being what they'd prefer to eat so they have some reasonable prices and you get two dollars off when you spend ten if you want to get ten dollars worth of this and maybe put ten dollars worth of this stuff back go ahead and do that it's up to you but find a way to work it into your deal and that's why it's not always good to follow someone's printable breakdown or to follow someone's video not even mine because at the end of the day you have to learn for yourself to get what your family needs and to save money doing it not just to get stuff just because someone else is getting it like how much dog food do you really need to donate if your kids are hungry I don't know who needs to hear this, but if it's for you, think about it. How many always discreets do you need if your husband is saying, honey, where's dinner? I gave you money to go to the store and you're coming back with Tide. I mean, just think it through. So if you need food and things like that, snacks for your kids, budget your money around what you need instead of just getting what's popular. Okay. And I said all of that with my cart full of what's popular, but I'm still going to go ahead with it and go ahead and check out. Okay, so if you have your items, make sure you add it up for yourself. Do not trust me. Do not trust anyone else. Add it up for yourself. I've always encouraged you guys to do that, and I'll keep doing it. Know for yourself and be sure. You know what, guys? I just realized that not everyone has the coupon that you need for the pawns on their account. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take one for the team. Now, if you have the pawns, get the pawns. Your total will be a little bit cheaper than what mine is going to be. But if you don't have the pawns, you're going to need a substitute. Now, a good substitute would be, and I'm going to take this away, to get the all detergent. So in this little gap, just mentally put all detergent and clip your all detergent coupon. Okay, so if you need to substitute and you don't have the coupon for the ponds or you don't want them, go ahead and get an all detergent. It's imaginary. It's right there. You just can't see it. Put the all detergent right there and clip your digital for a dollar off all detergent. Or another option, I don't do kid options very often, but might run you a little bit more than the ponds. The ponds would be your cheapest deal for those of you who are wondering. But if you need variations, getting the all detergent would be one. And the second variation would be getting a Suave Kids product that is priced at $3.15 or higher. You don't want to get the $3 Suave Kids product because then your total would be two cents short of $25, okay? So make sure you're getting something that's over $3, okay? So I'm going to go with this one because it's $3.15 and we have a $1 off smart coupon. 
So this is a variation. You saw what it looked like with the ponds, but it just hit me. Everyone may not have that one because it's one of the ones that you had to clip earlier in the month. So if you're brand new, this is a decent deal to try just how my cart looks right now. So if you want to do the other deal, go back and screenshot what my cart looked like then. And then here's your second option, what it looks like now. And this is the one that I'm pretty sure I'm going to do. Okay, so this is what my final cart looks like. And again, I'm getting the Suave Kids, number one, because Deja need this for her hair. I cannot just take her walking around with this frizz hair anymore. Number two, um, because it's a good variation for everybody who doesn't have that Pond's coupon. So let's go to the checkout and see how much this comes out to be. Okay, so now I'm coming to checkout. And let's see how much this comes out to be. Hopefully this is a good transaction. Hopefully everything goes well. So far so good. As I'm putting stuff up here, if you're doing this with me, go ahead and start writing it down. Just write everything down. Make sure you have your Ajax, your Snuggle. Gain is next for me. Then I've got my two Suave. And I have my one Suave Kids. Now for you, make sure you're either getting all detergent, clipping your $1 off digital, getting Suave Kids, clipping your $1 off digital, or you can get two of the ponds and clip your $2 off digital. That last item is your choice. If you're new to shopping at Family Dollar, when you come up to the keypad, you just want to enter your phone number. It says, please enter your number for your smart coupons, and you just come right down here to this keypad and start typing in your number. So I just entered my phone number. This total right now is showing everything with tags before coupons, so that was pretty scary. Okay guys, so this is what it's looking like. Look at all of the savings that came off. This is awesome. My subtotal is 1063 for all eight items. My subtotal is 1063 for all eight items. My subtotal is 1063 for all eight items. Guys, I am so hurt right now. Can you believe it? Oh my gosh, I'm so hurt right now. When I switched my plan, I completely forgot to clip the coupon for the Suave Kids. Oh my gosh, but you know what? You guys, remember to clip your Suave Kids coupon if you're doing this deal, and your total will be $9.63 plus tax, so you'll come out under $10. Now, if you get all detergent instead of Suave Kids, then your total will still come out under $10. And if you get the two ponds, then your total will definitely be lower than $10, and the ponds deal is the best deal of all. So instead of Suave Kids, you would get two ponds, and make sure you clip that $2 off Pond's coupon. So this for me was 1063 because I forgot to clip my Suave Kids coupon, but you guys will pay 963, so that's even better. You guys will do better than me. But to kind of redeem myself a little bit, I went onto my Ibotta app. And if you don't know what Ibotta is, it's a rebate app. You basically just take a picture of your receipt. It's super quick, super easy, super simple. Take a picture of your receipt on the app and they give you money back just for using the app seriously they give you money back it's like a rebate app you get instant rebates instead of like mailing them in i guess people don't like to mail rebates in anymore so i put my receipt on ibotta and i got 10 cents back and it doesn't seem like a lot but for me it eased some of my pain for overpaying and for getting to clip my suave kids coupon so ibotta gave me back 10 cents just for having a family dollar receipt. So that 10 cents made me feel a little bit better. You guys can do the same thing too. You'll pay 963 for all of this plus tax and you can get 10 cents back from Ibotta. Now, if you're new to Ibotta, you get an extra $10 just for signing up. And some people say, oh, I don't get my $10. I signed up for Ibotta using your link and I didn't get my $10. Well, if you don't get your $10, it could be one of two things. Here goes. Number one, you haven't used the app yet. In order to get your $10 bonus, you have to at least use the app once. They want to know that you didn't just download it just to bail. So you've got to at least purchase one thing that's on the app in your local grocery store. For instance, they might have a rebate for purchase any bubble gum and get, you know, 50 cents back. So they want you to at least go purchase some bubble gum and they'll give you 50 cents back. I mean, make sure you're buying things on Ibotta that you were going to buy anyway. I wouldn't just go use the app just to use it. Make sure it's something you're going for in the store anyway. And most of the times when I'm grocery shopping, I'm looking at Ibotta and I'm like, you know what? I was going to get bread and I wasn't really specific about what brand. So I'm going to get this brand that's on Ibotta. So make sure you're just taking that app around with you when you're in the store. And that's the best way to use the app, not to really just go around and buy things for no reason. Now, Ibotta gave me back 10 cents and then Fetch Rewards gave me back 96 points. 
Yes, I scanned my receipt on Fetch Rewards too. They gave me back 96 points. So Suave products are giving back a ton of points on Fetch Rewards. Now somebody's gonna say, what is Fetch Rewards? Fetch Rewards is an app that gives you back money too, except they give it back in gift cards. So it's really easy to earn on Fetch Rewards. You get points for anything on your receipt. As long as you're scanning a grocery receipt, like if you shop at Walmart, or Kroger, when Dixie, Stop and Shop, wherever. If it's a grocery store, scan your receipt every time you leave the store because you'll get points back and you can redeem them for gift cards as low as $3 gift cards to places like Target and Walmart. It's so easy. And just for signing up, you get a $3 gift card to start. So all of those links will be below. But we were here to talk about the family dollar deal. It's awesome. Three scenarios under $10. I paid more than $10 because I did not clip my coupon. And you guys remember in the video when I was saying it's important to know your breakdown for yourself. Even though I told you to clip the coupon, I still didn't clip it. So that's why it's important for you to know what you're doing before you're just running around listening to people. Know for yourself, be sure for yourself, because even people that are experienced like me can make mistakes. And this was the perfect example. Okay, OCC gang, that's the end of this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and I'm out.